are better ways to keep cool. Call KS Services and receive a new Bryant unit with no payments and no interest for 18 months. Stay cool now and pay later. Visit callks.com for more. It's the Weather Extreme video. This is the afternoon edition. This is for Monday, the 12th of October. I'm James Spann. Alabama's weather nice and quiet this week. A front comes through in dry fashion for most locations this evening. Tomorrow will be cooler and less humid. Let's take a look. There's the upper air look. We have a pretty good trough north and west of the state, pushing a surface boundary in here. And you can see the boundary on the visible satellite view. That front stretches from about Memphis down to Lufkin, Texas. And so far, it's been inactive. That was the radar at 222. But there might be a few isolated showers on that front this evening. But again, for most of you, no rain. Pretty warm day today. Mostly upper 70s and low 80s. Birmingham at 81. Highs go back in the 70s tomorrow. But the big difference, the lower dew points tomorrow, will be noticeably less humid. And around the nation, pretty chilly up north and out west. With 30s and 40s this afternoon, we'll kind of catch the edge of the air mass tomorrow. Then a really good pop of cool air comes in here with the next front Thursday night and Friday. On the watch warning map, pretty quiet around the nation. Got some wind advisories and red flag warnings for the central and western states. No severe weather expected through tonight. Maybe some thunder north of here. Tomorrow, very quiet. And Wednesday, very quiet. No convection across the country. Rain for the next seven days. Most locations dry, pretty typical for October. Uh, you see maybe a little bit for the Tennessee Valley. That's with that front this evening, the next front Thursday night, but for most locations dry for the next seven days. Thankfully, the tropics are getting quiet. There is that one wave in the central Atlantic, about halfway between the Lesser Antilles and the coast of Africa. Just a low chance of developing in the short term and over the next five days. Harsh winds aloft will likely prevent that thing from developing. So, model fans, here we go, the GFS. This is the 12Z run, ballot tomorrow at 4. Flow going zonal after the passage of the trough. And a beautiful day, sunny and less humid. We start the day in the 50s. The high will be in the 70s. Wednesday, sunny and warm. Low 80s are likely. Same thing Thursday, but that front is north and west of the state. And Thursday night, the front comes through. And again, you can see maybe a little narrow band of showers on the front, but the moisture is really limited. Most locations dry and a noticeably cooler air mass on Friday. See the thickness values coming way down. Highs drop in the middle 60s with a cool north breeze. The sky will be sunny and Saturday will start the day. And the 30s... And low 40s, many places could see their first frost of the season. But what a great day, sunny with a high between 67 and 71. Perfect for college football, anything else you want to do outdoors. No issues with tropical rains this weekend. And Sunday looks good. Uh, the sky's sunny. Start the day in the 40s, high in the 70s. Another front north and west of the state. And again, that probably comes through in dry fashion. And Monday, big cold trough to the north. And again, evidence of maybe a few showers north and west of the state, but most likely were dry with highs in the 70s. We've got 10 days. This is Thursday of next week, the 22nd. Again, western ridge, central U.S. trough. We're dry. Evidence of showers north of us. And evidence of some type of tropical mischief in the Caribbean. But the European says, nah. It's 10 days out. All of this could change. Not much rain for Birmingham for the next 15 days. The mean only about a half inch. And the numbers, you can see the big drop on Friday. High dropping to 65. Now, this is for Birmingham, the city. It's got 42 on Saturday morning. But many places over North Alabama will be in the 30s and really nice next week. And the new CPC outlook, this is for October 20th through the 26th. Temperatures pretty close to average around here. That's it for the Weather Extreme video this afternoon. We'll have notes on the blog. The next video here by 7 o'clock tomorrow morning. You can catch us this evening on ABC 3340 News at 4, 5, 6, and 10 o'clock. Thanks for watching. Have a great evening and God bless. There are better ways to keep cool. Call KS Services and receive a new Bryant unit with no payments and no interest for 18 months. Stay cool now and pay later. Visit callks.com for more.